In this video I would like to show you what options there are to use a Stream Deck to operate the Grand MA3 console. All functions work completely without a macro or plugin and can therefore be used directly in every show file. The corresponding syntax can be found at the end of this video. At the top left is the direct selection for the MATRIX area. If I press it, the MATRIX area opens. MATRIX settings can be entered here directly. Very important, I first have to determine for which axis I want to make the entries. Without first noting this, the MATRIX doesn't work. The first view is divided into different areas. In the upper line, I can then choose direct different fade times. The line below shows various delays and then one line further in the opposite direction. There are different wings at the bottom right. The reset function is located at the bottom left. The other input options are behind the routing button. The shuffle selection is also located here. The phase key serves a phaser input and shows a phase from 0 to 360 degrees. With this, I can then immediately apply the input to my phaser and try out different selections. At the top left, I keep coming back to the previous level. We still have the area special settings. Here I can first set individual fade and delay times. I have also direct access to four storage locations. The current MATRIX settings is saved with store. And with select I can then call up the saved settings again and again. The complete configuration can be pure chased at feeds.de. Now please click on the lower right symbol to subscribe this channel. And when you click the bell, you always know when there are new Grandma 3 themed videos. In the upper right corner, you can come straight to another video that might interest you.